to see the Titanic for the first time made my hair just stood up on the back of my neck and I couldn't believe what I was seeing. When the ship docks, I'm getting off with you. I saw it at the premiere. It was the height of any Hollywood fantasy and it reminded me of all the things that inspire anyone to come to Hollywood. I don't see what all the fuss is about. You could be blasé about some things, Rose, but not about Titanic. The first time I saw the entire movie was in London. I was so caught up in the emotional through line. It was so strong, the story of the lovers, that it took you away from this tragedy that was going to happen. I'm sorry, but that didn't build you a stronger ship. I remember when that ship starts to sink and they start turning out that surround sound. I was wondering if that, all that old plaster in the ceiling of the Chinese theater was going to start coming down on us. The stuff on the poop deck is phenomenal with Leo and Kate. And he says, when I tell you, take a deep breath. Because you get the impression that he's terrified as she is. But he's taking some of that responsibility away from her. We're going to make it, Rose. Trust me. I trust you. I have a personal moment in, in the film that I love. It was a scene when I'm waving and they flare. And Jim was shooting it and he said, Johan, you just you wait till you see this in the cinema. This is a fantastically cool shot. You're going to love this. Being there and remembering being in a lifeboat and turning and seeing other lifeboats coming down halfway and people screaming and all of this going on in this huge space. I mean, that's an image that I'll never forget. I just remember the word that comes to mind is exquisite. Yeah, this is where we first met.